Now looking for my content in AI, it's sort of like looking at my blender full of a smoothie and going, I wish there was a button that could unmix all of this and just give me the fruit again. I mean, I know AI is a black box. No one really understands it. Hey, I'm not an engineer. And I've been told I'll never understand it. And then a listener woke me up with a comment that just gave me like a triple take. Dang, it was so obvious. It's not that much of a black box. Maybe not one at all. Now, with AI tools to detect and protect copyright, there's no reason that you as a creator can't use AI to protect your work. And it isn't going to take you a degree in coding. You can set this up with a few clicks. Wow, that's sort of like a crack number one of AI. The fact that all these unicorns are pitching that it's a black box. And there's numerous sources, I'm going to share them in a minute, that are saying quite the opposite. For months, even back at TechCrunch Disrupt, I've been told that once you put your content into a large language model, it becomes tokens, right? We don't even know what they are. And they bank on that to say, hey, we don't even know. They're tokens now. They've been transformed. They're not your content. They say it's like mixing paint. You can't unmix it to take the colors out. It's only what it does when it's mixed together that matters. And it's not taking original content. It's learning from it. After all, you can't unmix it. You can't identify it. You can't find your actual content inside there, but that's part of the key to the black box. While we can't look inside, we can look at what comes out and we can look at what goes in. And there's a lot of things pointing to a much better world for creators than I would have thought of even a few months ago. Hey, I'm Declan Dunn, and this is the AI Optimist. And why wouldn't I believe what AI companies told me, right? It's a black box. It's all math, all statistics, transformed. You can't find it. I bought it. Totally, totally bought it. Thank you, listener, for pointing out the obvious and simple truths. There are ways to get your content out of AI, and if that's true, this whole copyright game blows up, and every large language model and trillion-dollar AI unicorn gets really nervous. Like when the New York Times spits out almost word for word its articles from ChatGPT. I'm going to show you how they claim to have done that in their legal papers. But the fact is, if I can ask AI what's in there, well, it's not memory. It's awful close if it's going to reproduce the exact same thing. And that's where copyright law blows this up. Similarity means copyright violation.